With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. The hybridization of nitrogen in the azide ion. So this azide ion, it is your N three minus means there are three nitrogens and contains negative charge. If I want to draw its structure, here it is your nitrogen forming this double bond, and here it is forming the double bond. Your nitrogen it contains five valence electron because it belongs to fifteen group. So here it is. This is contains negative charge over here. This contains positive charge over here. And here we are having one lone pair and it has negative charge over here. This is the most stable structure of your N three minus. If you see all species have all nitrogen have eight electron. If it talking about this, this is one two three four five six seven and eight. This negative is considered as a lone pair, so it is your eight electron. Here it is one two three four five six seven eight. It is eight electron. It is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So all species, all your each nitrogen consists of eight electrons. So they are completing their octet. It means it is your most stable structure. If I want to draw its resonating structure over here, if you see it, then this negative charge come over here. Then what it will form? It will form. This is your nitrogen like this, and here we get one negative charge. This will come over here, and this bond will go over here, and so it will get. Two negative charge over here, and here we are having positive charge, and we are left with the lone pairs. So this is how your structure form. This will have lone pair. This is like this. Again, if what happens, also you can say that the one time this will come over here. This will this negative and also have probability to go this side. So one time this will go over here, and then what will form over here? That is nitrogen again. It comes this positive charge. Now this this lone pairs have moved over here, so this get this nitrogen gets lone pair, and this again positive charge. So this already have a negative charge, so it got two negative charge, and this lone pair remain in sac. So this is like this. Now if you will see the this is your resonating structure. Now what we will see we will see the hybridization over here. If you see your central atom, this is your nitrogen. That hybridization it is calculated by your steric number, which is equal to number of sigma bond plus number of lone pair. If you see it over here, that nitrogen it has two sigma bond and there is no lone pair, which is steric number is two, so hybridization it is sp of your central atom. If I talk about your side atom, that is, if I talk about say this atom, here it is one sigma bond and two lone pair. One sigma bond and here it is. This is your lone pair. This negative charge also considered as a lone pair. It means they are having two lone pair. It means steric number is three, so hybridization it is sp two. Same as with this, it means your terminal nitrogen. They have hybridization of sp2. Talking about your central nitrogen, that hybridization that is sp. Fine. For class six to twelve, ITG and NEET level, trusted by more than five crore students. Download Doubt and App today.